Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, good. It's uh, the closer you are to the horse with the less less padding you need to put under, you know, the better it is. Cuz you you're closer to the horse. How does he feel today? He's what? More, we need all the energy. So energy is good. We guide it. That's our goal, you know. You don't want to, because eventually, if you want to ride dressage, after the warm-up, the horse should be at his peak, but also in terms of power. We just need to be able to control. We guide the, bow, the power in the right directions. Yeah? But we don't want the horse to be <laughs> all dull, you know, and all... Uh, like he smoked dope or something. So we want him to be really nice and fresh and responsive. Take the reins. Yes. Th keep the reins. Yes, good. Keep contact, pleasant contact. And let him walk. There you go. Let him walk. Connection. There you go. Good. Keep your seat and your leg pretty much straight. That's, let, that, that's how we start you try to start with. And then just at the beginning, just use a little bit the whip, a little tap with the whip back there, a little tap. And the rest stays all relaxed. A little tap, a little tap, there you go. Keep going, a little tap, there you go. Good. Keep walking, keep walking, good. Good, keep walking. And let's trot on. Take your time. Uh, po yeah, you can post a little bit on both reins. And a little touch with the whip. Just so he stays in front of you with hardly any of your aid. A little touch. Keep going. Good. Keep going. There you go. Yes, right on. Right on. <laughs> right on. Exactly. Right on. Yes. Little touch with the whip. Little touch. So you feel he has that go forward. Little touch. Yes. Little touch. Go on, go on. Good job. So you have, you feel, hey, I have that extra go. I have that extra forward. Yes. Keep going. Yes. Keep going. Good job. Keep going. Good. Just so, come on, come, come. Good. Let's change reins across the diagonal. Little touch. Exactly. And soft. Good. Keep going. Very good. So it's exactly beautiful. You don't even have the feeling you need to sit down especially heavy or you need to squeeze him forward. He is nicely in front of you. He's really nice in front of you. Touch him with the whip a little bit. There you go. Connection. Good job. Because him being in the right position and moving forward, stepping under the weight, very good, will, ex exactly, over the time, will open up his top line, will loosen up his top line. There you go. Connection on both reins. Good. Keep going, keep going. Yes. And your legs nice upright. Little touch with the whip. Little touch. Little touch. Keep going, keep going. Until he wants to go forward. There you go. Come here, big circle. 
Look up. Good. And touch him with the wrist. Keep going. Tap, tap. That's good. That's pretty good. Keep that. Good job. Keep that. Yes. And now sitting trot and the transition to walk. Good. Good job. Look up. There you go. Bring your shoulders back a little bit. There you go. Look at me. Shoulders back. There you go. That's it. And now just relax. There you go. So you, exactly, beautiful. Because on the long term, riding should be something really good for your back. You know? But for that, you need to sit nice upright. Don't go like this. Yeah? Try to sit nice upright. There you go. Good job. Now let's walk on. Take your time. Good. Connection. There you go. And walk. Good. And then just put the, the whip here a little bit. Here. Here. Good. Good. So he walks. Good. He walks. A little touch. Good. At the same time, you feel a pleasant contact here. Upper body. Yes. Connection. Good. And now let's trot on. But keep that, yeah, 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 keep the whip at the, for the beginning, keep the whip on the horse. Yes. There you go. Let go. And touch him. Touch him back there. So he drives you forward, not the other way around. Come on. He drives you forward. Stay here with me. Stay here. Good. He drives you forward. And again, little touch. Yes. So it's very little that you aid with the whip, but pretty consistent at the beginning. There you go. Until he really gets it. Then take the whip away and see how long he holds that forwardness on his own. If he doesn't, keep it on a little bit. There you go. All relaxed. Yes, beautiful. Because, go on, go on. Once you have him that well in front of you, keep going. Good. Exactly. Keep going. Yes. Stay relaxed. Stay relaxed. Good. There you go. Now prepare. Good. And the transition to walk. Good. Connection, connection. Good. Keep the contact. Once you have him nice in front of you, then just, you know, your seat stays. That is one thing that never goes away, you know? So your seat stays. And then feel, maybe I need a little bit more bend to the right, maybe a little bend to the left, or maybe just straight, you know? That, and you feel that with little changes in your hands, yeah? But the worst, while you do that, continues to go, yeah? Con continues to exercise his top line. The whole motion goes through his back. There you go. Nothing just, you know, happens just with his legs. Take your time and trot on. There you go. Keep, yes. That's it. Then just sit, sit. Forward, more forward. That, yes. That's the lead. Go forward, more, more. That's it. Go, go on. That's the least tempo. Go on. Let go. Yes, no kicking because that makes him tight in his center part. Little touch with the whip. Little touch, little touch, little touch. There you go. Little touch. Good. Little touch. Very good. Let go in the reins. Beautiful. And now go large. Keep going. It's all right. It's all right. Good. Beautiful. Keep going. Yes. Very good. And the better the horse goes forward, the more quiet you sit. 
Try to be all relaxed, all loose in your pelvis. Now go straight. Go straight. And touch. Very good. After the second corner, let's change reins across the diagonal. Good. Let him trot. There you go. Feel how he stays in trot. Look up. Yes. Go on, go on, go on. Let him trot. Yes. Beautiful. Keep the contact. Stay large. Stay straight. One more time. Outside rein. Keep going. Let go. Heels down. Go on. Go, 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 go. And shoulder stays out. Yes. There you go. Little bend. Good job. Keep going, keep going. Keep going, shoulder stays out. Good. And then come here, big circle again. Good. There you go. Good job. Very good, little bend, and then take your time, prepare, and let's canter on. Take your time, take your time, take your time. Good, and canter on. Good, and jump. Good, Keep, yeah, 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 keep the contact, up, up. Good. Now a 10 meter circle. Stay here, stay here. Up, 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 up. Good job, good job, beautiful. Up, 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 up. And now go bigger. Up, right, beautiful. Exactly. If you have time, pay attention to your seat position. Up, right. Little touch. Very good. And a little touch outside rain. Yep, yep, yep. And go large. At the next short side, go straight. Yes. We do a transition to trot. Take your time. Connection. Yes. Keep the contact. Let him go. Beautiful. Little touch. So you don't override him with your... And the transition to walk. Good. Pat him. Let me check the girth. Let me see if the girth goes. The saddle is in a good position. He doesn't slide forward or something, so he lays good. But... Uh, yes. There you go. All right, let's walk on. Good. Good. Let him stretch a little bit. There you go. Come here, big circle. Yes. And every time you, exactly, every time you go on a loose rein, the horse walks, stretches a little bit. You are the one that pays attention to your seat. Yeah? Take your time. Good. So eventually, let's do a halt. Let's do a halt. Now, if you sit on the horse, yeah, you want to sit in a way. If you, if somebody would get the horse out under you, you would land like this. <clears throat> yeah, because that's the position. If, if I would get the horse out of under you now, you would fall backwards because your legs are too far forward. Let's get, 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 go out of your stirrup. There you go. Now just sit down on your seat like this, and then let him long. And then just have a little angle here, a little angle like this. And then from your pelvis up, you're upright. There you go. Upright. There you go. 
That's the position, okay? Relax. There you go. And that's the position here, toes up. There you go. Okay? okay. Upright. You're leaning back again. There you go. Up. There you go. And then relax shoulders, all right? Upright. Upright position. There you go. Now let's walk on in that position. Don't change it. Let the, let the horse stretch. Walk on. Don't change it. Uh, upright. Good. Don't change the position. And keep your legs long. Very good. And when you walk, so the horse has a break because you've worked nice and hard, you take your care of your seat. Because middle in the, in the middle of riding, you know, there's so much more that you have to do. Nobody has the time to think of his seat, yeah? There you go. Look, keep, keep your upper body up. Look at me. Don't go to that position. Stay upright. There you go. Good. And toes to the horse, heels down. Good. And keep your upper, yes. Keep the position upright. That's it. That's, yes, much better. There you go. That's the position. There you go. Good. Now take the, also with your, with your lower leg, yes. Because if you could look down, straight down on your seat, you should sh see shoulder, hip, heel, yeah? One vertical, exactly, line. There you go. Then you're balanced and your seat can go just as much forward as it can go back, or just as free forward as it go ba goes back. Take the stirrups. Keep your upper body like this. Take the stirrup. They're, down, they're not that far down. They're high. Yes. <laughs> toes up. Toes up. There you go. There you go. T toes up. There you go. And now, heels down. Toes up. Toes up. Toes up. Toes up. Yes. No. No squeezing. There you go. Just toes up. Yes. No. That's the heel up. There you go. Yes. There they are. Let's do a halt. Let me do a halt. Hey, it's all right. It's all right. Don't worry. Take your time. Go from the. Take your time. That's, the, that's it. And now heels down. Just like you had it. You got the other one? Good. Let's walk on. Take your time. Good. Take your time. Now, you keep your, yes, heels down. Your seat position stays just like that. Upper body. Good. Much better. Now take the reins shorter. Very good. There you go. Oh, look at that. That's luxury. Look at Tomas getting in the. Take your time. There you go. Upper body position. Stay here in the circle. Now slowly start to touch him a little bit with the whip because you want to get him in that forward. Exactly. There you go. Mode. Contact. Contact. Good. Take your time. Now prepare. Yep, yep. Keep the, yeah, yeah. Keep the, yes. And let him trot on. Keep your seat position upright. Let him trot on. Take your time. Come on. Good. Go on. And a little touch with the whip. Yes. Let him go a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Very good. He doesn't have to run away. There you go. But you want him to reach forward so he starts to use his back. So he starts to use his top line. Little bit longer. Little bit longer the strip. Yes. Just a little bit. That's it. That's good. That's good. Keep that. Very good. Because at the beginning, you have to do that a little bit more often. You have to more consistent until he understands that's the size. That is the quality. Keep going. Good job. Little touch with the whip. Little touch. Very good. Keep the contact. Little bend. Beautiful. Keep that. Keep that. Now go large. Come, come. Let him trot. 
If he sucks back, the, yes, you need to feel that right away. And let's do a little bit shoulder in here on the long side. Good. Connection. Good job. Very good. And go straight again. Good. And one more time. Next long side. Good. Keep going. And round. Left rein, left rein. Keep going, keep going. That's beautiful. Did you feel the difference when he stays in front of you, you know, and you bring him in a shoulder in, you feel that that exercise makes him go even more through the top line. The back is coming up even better. Keep going. Very good. Keep going. Good. And round. Yes, beautiful. And again. Little bend. Beautiful. Keep going, keep going. Yes. Now take your time. Come here, big circle. Yes. And exactly. And when you cross the center line, canter on. Connection. Take your time. Take your time. Connection. And canter on. Good job. Go, 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 go. Go on. And touch him a little bit with the whip. Yep, yep. Yep, so it's a clear jump. Good job. Keep the contact. That is very good. You do that very well. There you go. Keep the contact and a little touch with the whip. Just a little tap, 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 tap. Very good. Tap, tap, tap. Very good. And round. Good job. Keep the contact. Keep the contact. And let's go large. Good job. Your seat stays straight. Come, 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 come. Exactly. Oh, ne next time, let's go straight. Take your time. Let's go straight, the whole arena. Keep the contact. Touch him a little bit. Very good. And then down there at A, we do a transition to trot. Contact. Keep the connection. Good. Take your time. And trot. And let's go across the diagonal. Yes. Let go in your seat. Beautiful. Let go. Good job. Let go. Stay large. Stay straight. And shoulder in. Let go. And touch him a little bit. Good job. Right on. He should not slow down just because he is in a shoulder in. Exactly. He should not slow down. Good job. Little bend. And again. Take your time. Good. Connection. Good, beautiful. Keep that contact. And again, little bit shoulder. Yeah, keep the contact, keep it. Very good, both reins. Good, beautiful. Take, yes. Now take your time. Come here, big circle around the center. And prepare, let's canter on. Round. Take your time. Go, come, go, 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 come, go, go. When he feels in front, yes. There you go. Keep that. Connection. Yes. Not faster, not faster. Round. Good. 
And now write the circle a little bit smaller around me. So all that, come here. Little touch, little touch. Come smaller, come smaller, come smaller. Little touch, come smaller. Exactly. With that, with that smaller line, you're forcing his inside hind leg to jump further under the weight. Come here. Come closer to me. Yes, come closer to me. Yes, come closer. Good. And bigger. That's beautiful. And bigger. And the transition to trot. Take your time, take your time, take your time. And steady. Very good. Right on. Beautiful. And the transition to walk. Good. Pat him, let him stretch. So all these exercises you know, should eventually Add the top line to the whole ride, yes? Should connect the hind to the front so the horse starts to be more supple and more through the top line. So basically what you have to keep in mind is when you get on the horse, when you keep, when you start to create connection, you want to feel that the horse is in front of you. If the horse is clearly in front of you, meaning that he carries you forward the whole time, yes? Then you can slow him down. You can ride the trot, for example, a little bit slower. Yeah? If you feel that the horse kind of sucks back, when you sit there and you have the feeling, oops, he's gone, you know? He's, kind, he's just going like that, up, but he's not progressing forward enough, yeah? Then you have to touch him a little bit and ride him forward a little bit more until he starts to come back into that, you know, into into that longer stride, yeah? And same th thing with the canter. You want to ride the canter pretty relaxed in speed. You don't want to go like, go, 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 go the whole time. But if you feel that the horse lets you work like crazy and not, nothing comes from the horse, you have to touch him a little bit with the whip. Eventually, that will get easier and we'll, you will not have to ride that much because the horse picks up, you know, he's quite a smart horse. He understands, you know, oh, you know, this is what my rider wants. And she's not that begging for it. She's asking me for it. If you do that for a while, the horse, we will, you will see, will automatically start out with a larger trot, trot step and all that. But that's, that's what it's all about. We want to, we want to exercise the top line the smaller circle, you know, does that, brings the inside leg more under the weight, so he, the top line comes up. Uh, lateral moves, shoulder in, you know, later on we're going to do half passes. All that helps that, but you don't, you want to sit as quiet and as upright as possible, yeah? And you want to stay away from a constant go, 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 because that would be like if somebody would hit you at every step here. You know, at one point you would go like, you know, when does that stop? You know, so you want to be totally quiet with your leg, leave it on, you use it, but then you keep it quiet again, yeah? Take your time, let's take the range shorter. Good. Both reins. Yes, exactly. Little touch with the whip and let him start, let him get into a rounder. What is that? Oh, okay. Exactly, into a rounder position. And walk, and walk. I can't teach when I drink fizzy water because I constantly have to go like. <laughs> <laughs> Take your time. Let's stay straight. <laughs> Keep that. Yes. Keep that contact. 
keep that. Yes. So the horse walks on. You feel that. You have, yes, that's beautiful. You can be totally gentle in the connection. And he walks on. Arturo's kids. <laughs> Arturo's daughters. No, no, no. Let, don't, don't worry. It's fine. I like it. Keep that. Good. Now prepare. Yes. Keep that pleasant contact. Good job. Yes, good job. And let's trot on. We stay, str we stay straight. Take your time. Inside leg. Yep. Stay straight. Yeah, touch him, touch him, touch him until he's fluently in front of you. Come on. Touch him with the whip back there. All you have to do is leave it on. There you go. He responds very nice to that. There you go. You just put the, the whip on his hiney. There you go. And leave it there. So at the beginning, yes. Your hand is a little, yes. Little wider. And the whip is just on him until he goes, until he drives you fluently forward, like easy. Little touch, all relaxed. Good. There you go. That's the, that's the minimum you want to ride him in. That's the bait. Yeah, yeah, keep going. Good job, good job. Keep it, keep the contact. There, keep the contact. Keep the, yeah, yeah, touch him there. Touch him back there. So he drives you forward and you're not constantly, yes, you don't constantly feel you need to add something. Keep going, keep going. Keep going. Half 10 meter circle, and let's do a half pass back. Shallow. Good. Look up. Forward side, but a little bent, little bent. Tiny little bent. Take your time, take your time. That's fine, that's fine. Little bent. And look up, look up. Don't think too much hind end. The whole horse. There you go. The whole horse goes over. There you go. And straight. Just get a little a feeling for that angle. And the same thing, upper body stays nice and straight and feel how he drives you forward. And we stay straight. Good job, stay straight. He drives you forward. Good, good. Keep going. Yes, yes, keep going. Yes, good job. Keep going. Go on, go on. Yes, good job. Little touch. So he carries you forward. And again, come down center line and a half pass right. All, there you go. All relaxed. Good. Keep going, keep going. Little bend, little bend. Keep the contact. Yeah, yeah, keep going, keep going, keep going. Yes. And go on, go on, go on. Very good. Exactly. And try to ride that more shallow, yeah, the angle. Just so once you come down center line, look up, for example, towards S, and then stay on the straight line. Yes, on a straight path towards S. Little bend, very soft. Keep that right on. Now look up towards S and ride him to that direction. Yes, right on, right on. Keep going. Look towards S. Keep going, keep going, keep going. 
But the sh exact lead. Right on, right on. That was pretty good. And straight. Good. Pat him and keep going. Good. Now here to this side, we do the same thing towards R. Yeah? Take your time. Very good. Good job. And round, look up, look up. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Look up. That was good, beautiful. Keep it, take your time. Yes, and canter on. Take your time, take your time, take your time. And stay straight. Well, uh, yes, good, 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 good. And straight. Yes. Next long side, a single serpentine. Connection, little bit in, and then all the way out. Connection on both reins. Good job. Canter. Take your time. And canter. Yep. Up. Good. Stay straight. Stay straight. Right rein. Stay straight. Good job. Stay straight. Now a single serpentine. Round. Good. And canter. Little touch, little touch, little touch, little touch, little touch. That was good. Little touch. Very good. Now a little bit forward on the long side. Take your time. Come, 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 come. Good. And change reins across the diagonal. Here in front of me. And the transition to trot. Take your time. And rhythm, good. Not faster, not faster. Good job, stay large, stay straight. Take the whip into your right hand. Connection, connection. Good. Now not faster, not faster, not faster. Good. And canter on. Take your time. Yes. And straight. Good. Beautiful. Next long side. Again, a single serpentine. Round. Little touch. Keep that. Keep it on. Keep touch. Keep him on. Good. And straight. Good job. One more time. Connection. Very good. And turn. In that part here, keep the whip on the horse. Good, 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 good. And straight. Exactly. Beautiful. Stay large. Stay straight. Very good. And again, let's change reins across the diagonal. Up, up, up. Here in front of me. Take your time. Round, straight, good, and the transition to trot. Good, keep the contact, keep the contact. Very good. If he has that much drive, that's perfect, yes? Just don't let it all out, yeah? It's happy, be happy that he goes, that he has that drive. Don't let him just, yes, Run away with that. Good. Keep that connection. Beautiful. Take your time. And straight. Yeah, yeah, go on, go on, go on. There you go. Exactly. That's it. Now, again, next long side. Let's stay straight and ride a little lengthening. Keep the contact. Keep, go on, go on. Yeah, let's go across the diagonal. A little lengthening, touch him a little bit with the whip and keep contact. So we got, 
get longer strides. Connection, go on, go on, go on. Go on. Keep your leg quiet. There you go. One more time here on the long side. Take your time. Connection. And come on. Go on, go on, go on. Touch him, touch him with a whip. Yes. Touch him with a whip. Little bit. Exactly. So he wants, he drives you forward. He drives you forward. Good. Take your time. And the transition to walk. Prepare and halt. Keep that contact. Take your time. Take your time. And halt. Just a halt. Stop. There you go. Connection. And let's walk on. Come. Take your time. Turn, 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 turn. Turn. Good. And again, prepare and halt. Keep the connection. Keep it. Contact. Yes. And walk on again. Yeah? Make him round. Make him rounder. Rounder. A little touch with the whip. Rounder. Rounder. Good. Even rounder than that. And halt. And he stays like that. Round. And keep the contact. Yes. And walk on. There you go. Good. Good job. Now pat him. Let him long. Put the whip under your leg. There you go. The whip under your leg. Just, yes. There you go. Under your knee. Put the, yes, the, the reins there. So they don't fall. Put the reins on the whip. Yes. That's good. Yeah, yeah. On the, yes. Good. And let them go. Now bring both of your arms here, back here. There you go. And then circle your shoulder back like this. Look. Up, back, relax. Try. No, no, no. Keep your leg, keep the, keep the arms here. The, the hands, both hands there. There you go. Let him walk wherever he wants. And now circle, up, back, relax. And then forward again. Look at me. Forward, up, back, relax. There you go. Yes, let him walk wherever he wants. Yes. Good? Doesn't matter. Walk on. Now again. Good. And up, back, and relax. Good. And again. Forward. Relax your arms. Let them fall down. Yes. Shoulder goes forward. Up, back, and then relax. There you go. Good. And then just keep it there. All comfortable. There you go. And again, one more time. Forward, up, back, relax. There you go. Forward, up, back, relax. There you go. Good. Because eventually, when you do sitting trot, your shoulder should be able to do that. Yeah? Totally free. And see, that's a good thing about an indoor arena. You can let him walk wherever he wants to. It doesn't matter. There you go. As long as you have this, the rain in case he runs away. Good job. Well done. He will loosen up. He will